Hey everyone, Matt from soundrolling.com, just here with the Red Epic, just wanted to make a better kind of syncing video. Um, so underneath, you'll see there's a little four pin limo right there for sync, and that's where you're gonna put it in. Uh, both Scarlet and Epic are four pin limo, Red one is five pin, if you're case you're doing any other types of cameras. Um, so menu settings, press menu, top right, and so first we'll go into uh, do the time code so project settings project time code and it's just these settings so just time of day the brain is kind of the main body of everything um, if there is a rear module you can have it uh, but it's it's unlikely that they'll uh, put that on for you um, and then if we go back we can also set the fan settings now there's been a lot of updates on them so if we go sorry so if I go completely off the menu so menu and then it's, oh, settings, then it's setup, then it's fan control, and you want to go on this adaptive preview quiet mode. And what that does is it basically uh, keeps the red at a certain target temperature and will only engage the fans to make sure that it just doesn't overheat. So once you click that, default is going to be 65 for target temperature, which is pretty good. Um, and you can say the maximum uh, record speed of the fan. So I usually do about 30, 35. Um, it's, it's only really gonna be become uh, sort of a hassle in kind of longer takes, uh, basically because as, the, as you're recording, the camera gets hotter and hotter and hotter. And so then eventually it'll start engaging it and slowly building up the fan speed. But otherwise, if you're just in short takes, like minute, two minutes, three minutes, then you're completely fine. So that's that.